Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper and this is my two-minute entertainment rundown for the week of November the 11th. Science fiction movie Curvature. It's about time travel. I always like movies like that. This one is a little bit slow at the start though and it never quite catches up. It leaves you a little bit, you know, with a murky solution to the whole issues in the film. It's not rated, but it probably are because of profanity and violence. I scored it 4 out of 10. Then we have Disney's The Nutcracker and The Four Realms. Mackenzie Foy stars as Clara, a girl trying to uh, unlock a present that's been left to her by her deceased mother. It's kind of a metallic egg and she needs the key to open it up. She travels into a land of the four realms by chasing after a mouse who has the key. The movie itself you know, it's, it's glittery and glossy, but not so much for me. It's rated P, PG, just for suspense about Clara. I scored it 4 out of 10. Then we have The Girl and the Spider's Web. This is another movie about Elizabeth Salander, uh, who is a, a Swedish woman who solves crimes, etc. She was played by Rooney Mara in the first film. Now she's been replaced by Claire Foy. This film is rated uh, are because of profanity and violence. It never is quite as good as the first one. I scored it 5 out of 10. Finally, we have Dr. Seuss's The Grinch, an animated film about the Grinch stealing Christmas. Once again, it's not as good to me as the Jim Carrey version in 2000, but it's still good. It's got a lot of heart to it. The film is rated PG because I guess the evilness of the Grinch stealing Christmas. I scored it 6 out of 10. Next week, we'll be talking about these movies, definitely. Uh, Fantastic Beast 2, the sequel to the first one, the J.K. Rowling story. Also, Widows and Instant Family. This has been Jackie K. Cooper's 2-Minute Entertainment Rundown.